Did you know that peanuts are a major product of Green Island? The peanut grows well on the outlying island, buffeted as it is by waves and wind. We met up with several expert food producers to find out how they make peanut candy and peanut tofu on the popular tourist island. Peanuts and sand are fried together, filling the kitchen with an amazing aroma. Then the peanuts are sieved and rubbed clean of their skins. They're poured into hot syrup, and soon the peanut candy is complete. Visitors to Green Island have always enjoyed diving and relaxing in the island's hot springs. Now they can add a new activity to the list, making authentic handmade peanut candy. Oh, how good. Mm. At weddings and festivals on Green Island, peanut candy is an obligatory part of the traditions. The winds off the ocean are strong here, and the land is full of salt. Few crops can survive. Peanuts are one of the most common crops. They can also be pressed and made into peanut tofu. The excess peanut pulp is poured into molds and weighed down with bricks to press any excess water out. The handmade tofu comes out as white bricks with a subtle peanut scent. It has that peanut taste and it's very silky, not like ordinary tofu. It's softer and silkier. It has a firmer texture and has a very slight salty taste, but a strong peanut scent. It has a higher fat content and it's different from the normal soy tofu you see on the market. Green Island is remaking its reputation as a destination for foodies alongside its fabulous sun, sea and sand.